All right, what's up, everybody? How's it going? Happy Wednesday. I hope you're all doing well. We're going to try and get a couple hours in here of Rutgers football here in College Football 25. As always, I'm Ray Carcillo. We're also going to start to TikTok here. Washington versus Rutgers. This should be a good one. A real... I mean, if Virginia Tech wasn't a test, this surely will be. Uh, but boy, oh boy, was that a tough game against Virginia Tech. Obviously, we came back and won it in the last second, 28-24 see if we can't replicate our success here against the Huskies. So this should be interesting. We'll see what happens here as the Scarlet Knights take the field at SHI Stadium in Jersey, in Central Jersey. And hope you're all doing well. What's up, Antelope? How's it going? So Rutgers versus Washington. This should be an interesting one. Both teams undefeated. Uh, yes, I don't think Virginia Tech was ranked. If they were, they were like 20-something or whatever. Uh, as this will be a touchback. Antelope Baseball will be back next week. So you see there, Kyle Kamakis, Not the greatest quarterback, but getting the job done. So Monogai, the tailback, uh, playing Dynasty. Uh, Antelope, what's up, RTO? How's it going? Hand off to my guy, Monogai, and he makes a gain of two on first down. No, awesome. It's it's. I'm playing as Rutgers. Anthony, I, I have no idea, like, at this point. Out of the gun, another handoff to Magai. Monogai, another good gain. But it's going to be interesting to see what happens here on third and four. Third and manageable for Rutgers. Again, out of the gun. And looking for and finding the tight end over the middle. That's Tuck up to the Rutgers 44. And a big third down conversion there for the Scarlet Knights. Anthony, probably Baltimore and Philly. Hand off to Monogai. Trying to bounce and get outside. Picks up a yard, maybe two, as he falls forward. Madden, thank you for the roses. Oh, that stinks, Jackson. I'm sorry to hear that, dude. No, Solis, I didn't cave. It's what the fans wanted. I actually had donations... Donations were given to me by the community demanding that I play college football this week. So I, that's, I mean, it didn't cost me anything. So as that catch is made, and now Kyle Monogai, this is a bad sign for Rutgers. Monogai goes down after a six yard completion to the tight end. Yeah, the Yankees are going to probably stink in the second half, Jackson. Like, I mean, I don't know what else to say. Like, I hope they don't, but we'll see what happens. That was Konepka on the catch. So Brown now in for Monagai, and now a handoff to him to the right side. Looking for running room and rumbling his way forward for a first down. Brown usually the spell back, now pushed into emergency duty. Thank you, Solis. Uh, FAU, Finnegan, Florida. Go to Florida. As this one handed off to Brown, throws a stiff arm, bouncing it outside. He's not as fast as Monogai, but he's got some great strength. And Monogai is out the rest of the year. It is official. He has torn his pectoral muscle. His season is over here in only the fourth game of the year. He was a workhorse. He was starting to come out as a Heisman candidate. He had over 150 yards in three straight games, and now it's up to Brown. What can Brown do for you? Well, he'll pick up another few and make it third and two. Vetter, uh, uh, not vet, varsity, Jacob, whatever the second difficulty is. Another handoff to Brown to the right side, out running tacklers, picks up another first down as again moves the chains. But everybody's in Rutgers Nation now. Scarlet Knights Nation devastated by the tough news 
As now a handoff up the middle. And the third string back will get this one. As it's next man up here in Jersey. Second and four coming up for the Scarlet Knights. Another three tight end set. 3-0, and Jackson, very early still. Play action to Brown, and it's going to go to Brown. Caught over the middle. Found the soft spot in the zone, and it's another Rutgers first down. So a battle of two undefeated teams here. Washington 4-0, Rutgers 3-0. Hand off to Brown. Finds a seam and picks up four as he falls forward to the 15. I'm decent too, Jacob. I went 7-3 and three in my first 10 online, so... Another pistol formation. Play action to Brown. And down goes Kalkamakas. He had nobody open and nowhere to scramble to. So third and 15 now coming up. Probably not, Jackson. Probably not going to get Madden 25. Yeah, I know. RTO, no! Didn't see him, Aiden. That's If he was, I didn't see him. Had a shotgun. Looking for the man underneath. Catches uh, dropped by Konepka. So the drive will stall. And now Rutgers will try for a 41-yard field goal attempt. And Patel is good for the first time this year. He's now one for three. And Rutgers takes the opening possession and marches it downfield and gets three on the board. Probably Jackson. But a nice long four and a half minute drive took up almost the entire first quarter. As now Rutgers will send it deep to the goal line. And good coverage downfield. Washington will start at their own 16. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Weebo. I appreciate that. Will Rogers. Obviously, with uh, Penix Jr. now in the NFL for the Falcons. Rodgers under center here for Washington. Very much so, Alex. Just on, uh, uh, what's it, Varsity Brady? The, no, the, the second difficulty? So, a nice slant route, broken tackle. And a big gain on first down for 21 for Washington. So it doesn't matter who's under center. This fast-moving offense. As Rodgers hurries up under center. And a nice... Oh, might have been a hold there, but nothing called. Malcolm Ray, though, with the tackle. After a gain of five. Washington trying to get one more playoff before the end of the first quarter. Rodgers in shotgun. And he will not get the snap away. Yeah, Chris, that'd be great. Woke up this morning... What's up, Logan? How's it going? So, 3 nothing Rutgers at the end of one. Washington, though, near midfield. No, we, I don't do com WWE because WWE is too fast-paced in video game form. I, I have done wrestling commentary professionally uh, for an independent circuit league back in Jersey. Is this? Oh, and it's the Jets sweep! And a good job by the Rutgers defense to stack the receiver up right at the guard to gain. So this is going to be a close one. Third and inches at the 47. What's up, Chris? Rodgers in shotgun. And oh my, oh, what a pickup of the blitz there. The play action, but a good job by the corner to punch it out. And the Washington drive stalls on third and inches. The linebacker blitzed, blew up the running back, but it was good play action. And now a short punt that'll be fair caught by Braywaite at the 30th. Uh, the 30th, excuse me. Rutgers, Logan. PJ, I only got it because fans, which I'm very grateful for, donated the money. They wanted to see this so much. They donated the money to me to get this early. Yeah, RTO, I think skip Madden, get college football. That's right, Chop. Chop, baby, as Brown up the middle picks up four. We both thank you for the follow. Much appreciated. 3 nothing Scarlet Knights here early in the second quarter. Kalkamakis in shotgun. Brown to his right. Play action pass. 
Looking for a man over the middle. Oh, he's got him in right. He's got him in stride. What a catch and into Washington territory. Kalkamakis finds his man in stride. And it's first down, Scarlet Knights. Another handoff to Brown. Bounces off one would-be tackler. Spins out of another and falls forward for four. Some hard yards there for Samuel Brown, the fifth. Just using veteran uh, or uh, varsity, Jackson. No, Logan, I no longer live in New Jersey. Handoff to Brown. Cuts it back. A little counter play there. Picks up three. It'll be third and three from the Washington 37. Another handoff to Brown. And goes up the middle. Picks up four or five more. Sure, Brady. I go to Yankee games. I went to the Yankee games in San, San Diego this year. As I hand off to the third string running back. And it's a flag on the play. Might be in the realm of holding. Yeah, so that's going to come back. Washington will take it. So it's a 10-yard penalty. It'll be first and 18. Hand off to Brown back in there, and he'll pick up. The, he'll get that penalty yards back, yard backage, and then some penalty yardage back. That's what I meant to say. Thanks, Christian. So second and nine now for Rutgers. Kalkamakis in shotgun. Looking for a man over the middle on the crossing route. He's got him. That's, I believe, long down to the three. And it's first and ten. Scarlet Knights continuing to move. No, I never met Soto, Jackson. Oh, Dalton, that sucks. And it looks like we got a QB keeper. And Kyle Kamakis will get pushed forward for about two. Trying to get Washington off guard. And, well, it didn't work. <laughs> Washington was ready for it. Kyle Kamakis picks up a pair. Uh, ever met a Yankees? I'm trying to think. I met a lot of new. I met some. I met a lot of New York Giants. I met some, a lot of New York Rangers. As that's gonna go for two. So third and six coming up. Third and about medium. As we hit the two minute warning here in the first half. Third and six. Play action to Brown. Looking for somebody. And, and Kalkamakis is going to take it himself. Kalkamakis into the end zone. Nobody was open. He had a route to run. He had a lane. He took it. He put on the afterburners. And Rutgers finds pay dirt. Touchdown, Scarlet Knights. Kalgamakis looking, 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 and says, fine, I'll just do it myself. Uh, Sean O'Hara went to Rutgers, didn't he? As the extra point is true, and it's 10 nothing. I'm trying to remember what his alma mater was, because I met Sean O'Hara after the Giants won the Super Bowl. He was the center for the Giants in Super Bowl 42. I met him and David Deal uh, while I was at ESPN. So technically, in that regard, he was a, a Rutgers alum, if I'm correct. Is, uh, if somebody could look that up for me, I can't remember. So, so far, Rutgers has come out and hit the Huskies in the mouth. A shocker for sure. After narrowing, upsetting Virginia Tech last week, as that's going to be caught in the flat for a... Uh, or in an out route towards the sideline for a first down. Rogers three for four now on the day. Looking to try to upset the number nine ranked Huskies. Rogers again in shotgun. Rutgers rushed four, quick slant route, one broken tackle. And the receiver falls forward for nine. As Washington, who gets the ball to start the second half, goes to a hurry up. A minute 35 left in the first half, 10 nothing Scarlet Knights. I wouldn't go that far, uh, Christian. Gus is very good. As, uh, this one is going to be caught. Quick tackles made. But it is a first down, and the Huskies move the chains. 
<laughs> yeah, RTO, it was great. Right down to the wire. Rogers again in shotgun. Again, what, Rutgers rushes four. The pass is knocked away. Good job there by the corner. So second and 10 from the Rutgers 47. Pocket collapsing. Rodgers gets rid of it though to the flat and a good tackle made. Closing speed there. And it's third and five. Huge third down here as SHI Stadium is rocking here in the swamps of Jersey. Pass is caught. It's held on to as the receiver. He paid a penalty. Little high-low action there as we're under a minute to go, but he moves the chains. Rutgers sends the, sends the house, and a quick pass is caught. And now a timeout by Washington. Next week, Logan. We're we'll back to baseball next week. First and 10 at the Rutgers 24 now for Washington. Sure, when we get the ball back. And a handoff up the middle, and another timeout for Washington. So now Washington doesn't want to score too quickly. Second and six from the Rutgers 20. They're in field goal range. They want to at least come away with three here. Obviously looking for seven as Rodgers hit as he throws, gets the ball to the flat, and it's a loss of one. And it's third and seven. Clock is ticking. Tick, 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 tick. And Rodgers will throw it away. He had nobody there. The pocket was collapsing. And the Scarlet Knights bend but do not break and will force Washington to try for three. From 38 yards away, the kick is good. And it's a one-score ball game. Uh, varsity sneak. Right? It's not, not all American and not Heisman. So, yeah, was it, but also not freshman, which is the easy one. So 10-3 Rutgers. Rutgers does have all three of their timeouts. Could they get some big yardage to try to maybe get them that field goal back? We'll see. Rutgers will start at their own 21. Sneak, you play how you want to play. I'll play how I want to play. Out of shotgun. Looking for the tight end, Konepka, but he drops it. Second and ten. Thanks, Alex. I appreciate it. All right, Sneak. Well, you're the first person I've heard that says that Heisen was easy. So, good for you, my friend. Well, it depends on the level, Jackson. But if you're a big leaguer, it's a wood bat. Again, out of the shotgun. Looking for Konepka, the tight end. He's got room to run. And Rutgers will use a timeout as they move the chains. So a gain of about 13 on second and 10. They need about 30 more yards to realistically try the field goal. No, you can't, Jackson. Thanks, Sneak. Play action to Brown. Looking for, and making the catch! He made the catch! Down to the 24-yard line! Between double coverage, and I believe that's Miller goes up and hauls it down! What a catch by Miller! And now with eight seconds left, Rutgers is at their own 24. Hand off to Brown, who kind of goes up the middle, tries to get a little bit closer, tries to center the ball a little more. Thank you, Alex. And with three seconds left in the half, Rutgers going to try to get this these points back. Not a chip shot for Patel. The kick is shanked. It's no good. Patel pulled it to the left. And this stays a one-score game as he falls to one and four. One for four, I should say, on the season on field goal attempts. 
Sure, Brian. So, that's why I was I was trying to get more center with that handoff, but unfortunately couldn't get there. Because if the if it was more center, he would have nailed that. But kicks are very hard, Brady, to make in call in in this game. I'm one for four on field goal attempts because it's not just the power; the accuracy is is, is much harder, much much harder. Especially if you're on one of the far hash marks. So Washington will receive. They were fortunate that basically the half ran out. It looked like Rutgers was driving again as this kickoff will go to the back of the end zone and it'll be a touchback. Rodgers in shotgun for Washington. 10-3, Scarlet Knights start of the second half. Hand off. Oh, it'll end the round. And Rutgers was not fooled. Oh, what good contain on the backside by Aaron Lewis. And it's a six-yard loss. First season still, can We just started yesterday. No, Jackson. Field goals are hard no matter what your difficulty is. Rutgers now rushing four. Pass caught over the middle. Good tackle there. Only a gain of four. Third and 12. Rodgers in shotgun. Good pocket. Now starting to collapse. Has a man underneath. And he breaks a tackle. The running back making moves. Oh, my goodness. Two missed tackles. Allows the running back on the little dump-off pass over the middle to get the first down and move the chains for Washington. Huge conversion. And now they hand it off to the running back who picks up only three. Because I'm from Jersey, G. I'm playing Juice, yes. Madden's much easier, Jackson. Absolutely. For kicking, yes. <laughs> nice, Holden. Rodgers in shotgun. Rutgers sends four. Pass is going to be caught underneath on the post pattern. And Washington, man, that third down conversion was huge. As now they are... Well into Rutgers territory. Rodgers again in shotgun. Changing the play. And they hand it off to the running back who breaks another tackle and then falls forward for five. Second and five. Why do my audibles keep popping up? Oh, the buttons must be sticking. Rutgers with the run blitz. Good job there by the Scarlet Knights as Dixon makes the tackle. And be third and four after a gain of one. Veteran G or, or varsity. Third and four. Rodgers again in shotgun. And has a man over the middle. Oh, he got his legs taken out nicely by the safety. But that is going to be another first down for Washington as Moore makes the catch. Rodgers again in shotgun. Zachary, I only got it because fans donated the money to me. Blitz by Rodgers. And Rodgers hit as he throws. So the, the blitz gets there, but Rodgers gets the pass away. And it'll be second and ten. So Rodgers able to save the loss of yardage. Now an empty backfield. Rutgers sending four. Has a man over the middle again. Thread the needle into double coverage. And it's third and five. Washington to convert. Looking to convert their third, third down of the drive. And they fool Rutgers with a draw play. It's going to be first and goal. First and goal from the two. Man in motion. Jet sweep. Rutgers ready for it. Loss of two. Second and goal from the four now. Rodgers in shotgun. Three receivers set. And another handoff up the middle and the running back outruns the tackler. Touchdown Huskies. 
And we're an extra point away from a tie ball game as Coleman finds Pater from four yards out. So Washington marches down the field in three minutes and ties the game. That missed field goal by Rutgers at the end of the first half looming large now. Can the Scarlet Knights answer? Again, already a rough game. Their starting running back out for the season tore his pec in the first quarter. As they get an okay return back to the 18. I mean, Penix is in the NFL now, G, so Penix is no longer in college football. Hand off to Brown, up the middle, picks up two, almost three, and it'll be second and eight. There's a lot of injuries this year, Eldon, yeah. Second and eight, hand off to Brown, looking for a hole, finds a small one, picks up maybe another two. Third and six now for the Scarlet Knights. Trying to answer the long drive by Washington. Trying not to go three and out. And play action on the jet sweep. And Kyle Kamakis, it's a fumble! It's a fumble! He's hit! They caught a fumble! It's a scoop and score! And Washington takes the lead! 16 to 10! Oh my goodness! What a terrible, terrible turn of events for the Scarlet Knights! Yeah, Joe, next week. Kyle Kamakis, as he was throwing, and it just, whoop, slipped right out of his hand. Nobody there to help. Easy scoop and score. Valdez with the scoop and score. And it's suddenly Washington has their first lead of the day. It's 17-10 Huskies. Nice, Holden. Yeah, that's a good one. You could hear a pin drop in Piscataway. And now looking for a good return. Gets it back to the 20. Well, that's what happens. They got the second half kickoff and then a scoop and score. That's what happens. The pass rush got there. It's very good, Joe. Yes. So Kyle Kamakis now ice cold out of the shotgun. Looking for the man underneath. He has him. And that'll be a first down as he turns up field. So first down Scarlet Knights now at their own 30. Gain of about almost 11. Bad snap. Kalkamakis looking for a man. And it's going to be... Oh, just tipped away. First I thought it was going to be caught. Then I thought it was going to be intercepted. And then it just falls harmlessly to the turf. Tried to thread the needle a little too much there. Kalkamakis again in shotgun. Looking for Konepka underneath. Picks up five. And it's third and five. At the Rutgers 36. Yeah, Holden, he laid out to get a fingertip on that one. Play action to Brown. Nobody fooled. Looking for a man. Those got him in stride. That's Miller. Miller had the big catch at the end of the first half. And somehow they find the soft zone. That's probably his best throw of the day, Kyle Kamakis, as he's able to put just enough touch on it. And it's first down Rutgers. Now into Washington territory. This will be the last play of the third quarter at the Huskies 36. Hand off to Brown. Looking for room to run. And maybe picks up a yard. It'll be second and nine. But at the end of three quarters here at SHI Stadium, it's 17-10 in favor of the Huskies. Spyro, thank you for the follow. Rutgers dominating in time of possession, but the one turnover of the day right now is the difference in this ball game. Funny enough, no, G, I have not. Kalkamakis in shotgun. 
Four-man rush for Washington. Looking for the man again underneath. And again, that's Miller trying to outrun guys. Has the first down as he picks up about 15. Miller having a real nice game today. And he's going to go back to him again underneath route. And he'll pick up nine. Gee, that's what the schedule is, dude. Uh, varsity, Jonah. Hand off to Brown. Up the middle. Cuts it back down to the six. Rutgers moves the chains. It'll be first and goal from the six-yard line. Kyle Kamakis in shotgun. Again, looking for Miller underneath and down to the two. Created my own coach, Holden. The coaches aren't, the real life coaches aren't in the game. No, playing on varsity, Braden. Second and goal from the two. BCE, folks donated and I bought it. Sure, G, but not all of them. As Brown up the middle cannot get there. Me third and goal from the two still. Again to the goal line formation. Play action to Brown. Looking for Tuck, and he drops it. Fourth down coming up now. And Rutgers going to go for it. Can't settle for three. Fourth and goal from the two. Hand off to Brown. Up the middle. Touchdown! He broke the plane. And Rutgers is an extra point away from tying it back up. The Scarlet Knights are able to answer. What can Brown do for you? Sammy Brown, the fifth up the middle, finds pay dirt. And the extra point is true, and we are tied at 17. No, Jonah, too early to go for two. Had to, not, not too late, or late in, yeah, too, you know what I mean. It was a good time to go for the touchdown, but we don't need to go, it's still early enough not to go for two. As good coverage there, and Brown makes the tackle on special teams, and Washington will start at their own 17. No, Panda, I'm just from New Jersey. I went to a D3 school. Empty backfield for Washington. Rodgers in shotgun. Rutgers sends the blitz. Pass is knocked away. Safety popped the receiver. Oof, that was a dangerous pass. And a nice play there. Uh, yes, Jeremy. Hockey, baseball, wrestling. What's up, Garcia? How's it going? Rutgers sends four passes. Caught. No, he dropped it. He had it in his hands. It's another drop. Man, Rutgers really hitting these receivers hard. Henry, I'm not, I'm from North Jersey. I'm closer to Yankee Stadium than I ever was to Philadelphia. But there's only one college team in Jersey, and it's Rutgers. And it's Rutgers gets their first sack of the day. Right? Hofstra doesn't have a football team anymore. There's no football team at St. John's, or I don't know if Seton Hall has one. But anyway, Rutgers, Aaron Lewis, his second big play of the day, his second tackle for loss, his first sack. And Rutgers forces Washington to go three and out. And suddenly, this could come down to the wire. Now I live in California, Logan. McAllister, the punter, sends it back to about the 45. Taken there by the return of Braithwaite. Trying to outrun guys. Shakes one tackle and takes it back to Washington territory. It's going to be a short field for Rutgers. Hand off to Brown. He's got a lane. He's got a block downfield. Brown shaking tacklers. A 24-yard gain on first down. By far his longest run of the day. Nobody cares about the Ivy League, Dakota. 
That's also true, Max. Rutgers is more, if there, if there is the myth of Central Jersey, Rutgers is really more Central, although there is a Nork campus. As that'll be a gain of two. Second and eight. 17-17, Rutgers trying to pull off the upset for the second week in a row. Actually, yeah, that's true, G. Going to waste some time here, let the clock run a little bit. Sounds good, Dakota. Much appreciated, buddy. Two and a half left here in the fourth. Kyle Kamakis out of the gun. And Kyle Kamakis is going to take off. He's going to go, and he's going to be down to the four. And the clock keeps running as he stayed in bounds, and this will take us to the two-minute warning. Kyle Kamakis scrambles for the third time today. A big gainer there. I think so, Jonah. Yeah, I think it's only on the next gen. Hand off to Brown now to the right side, and he walks into the end zone. Touchdown, Scarlet Knights! Rutgers retakes the lead with less than two minutes to go here in the fourth. But with all three of their timeouts, Washington has plenty of time to answer. I'm not going for two, BCE. The extra point by Patel is good. And again, that missed field goal by Patel at the end of the first half looms large. But Rutgers goes 46 yards in four plays. As this will be sent to the goal line. Good special teams coverage by Rutgers. And Washington will have to go 84 yards in a buck 55 if they want to send this game potentially to overtime. Back and forth, like two heavyweight boxers. This one over the middle, oh, almost intercepted. Where was Rodgers throwing that one? Moses Walker had it in his hands and the receiver looked more like a cornerback there. Second and 10, pass to the flat is caught and shoved out of bounds. So a five yard gain, again, of course, it's four, it's four down territory here. So getting five and out of bounds isn't the worst play for Washington. There's not many of us, Pigeon. As this one is caught. And a timeout for Washington as they pick up six and move the sticks. Next week, Jaden. They'll be back next week. Empty backfield. Rutgers sends four. Pass caught over the middle. Another gain of 10, maybe 11. Rodgers in shotgun. First and 10 at the Washington 38. Pass is overthrown and incomplete. Second and 10 coming up. Next week, Jaden, we're back next week. Rodgers in shotgun, minute 32, second and 10. Pass is dropped. He dropped it. So third and 10 now, starting to get to dicey territory here. Again, out of the shotgun. Three receivers set. Pocket collapsing. Receiver dropped the ball. What a play by the safety to come in and absolutely blow up the receiver. That would have been a first down. And this is the game right here. Fourth and 10 from the Washington 38. Good pocket for Rodgers. Has time. And he drops it. Four straight drops. And Rutgers just has to get one first down. And the game is over. I don't know, Logan. I'm probably more a baseball guy when it comes to commentary, but I'm enjoying myself as a handoff to Brown. And Washington uses their second timeout. Second and eight now. Handoff again to Brown up the middle. Picks up two, maybe three. So now what are you going to do? It's third and six. A first down wins the game. An incomplete pass. 
helps Washington. You're right at the edge of Patel's field goal range. Third and six. Play action. They're going to throw. And Kalkamak has just got rid of it, but it's incomplete. And now this is not easy. The kick is up, and it is short. It's no good. His second miss of the day. And Washington has a chance. About a yard short from Patel. He finally had one right on line. Thank you, RTO. But it falls short. And Rutgers now can't believe it. Two missed field goals today. Could be the difference in this game as Washington has new life. A minute seven to go. Washington at their own 35. No timeouts. Pocket collapsing. Pass is caught at the 50. And Washington has to scramble. It's very hard. Cameron, it's hard on any difficulty. I'm on varsity and it's hard. Under a minute to go. Pass is caught, but it's inbounds. Only a five-yard gain. Tick, 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 tick. And Rodgers spikes it. It's third and five. NYR, thank you for the follow. Third and five from the Rutgers 43. Rodgers in shotgun. 46 seconds to go. The snap. Rutgers sends four. He's got time. Oh, it's knocked away. Well, now for sure this is the game, folks. No doubt about it now. If Rutgers holds them here, they'll take a knee. The game is over. Washington needs five yards. The pass is caught. Oh, a beautiful mess route. Beautiful mess route for Washington. But again, they have no timeouts. 35 seconds to go. And again, Rodgers spikes it. Second and 10 coming up. Now at the Rutgers 34. Trips to the left side. Rutgers with the blitz. It's picked up. It's picked off. It's picked off. That's the game. Rutgers knocks off Washington. Rutgers improves the 4 and 0. Rodgers threw it right to the linebacker. And the drive dies at the Rutgers 27. Tyreen Powell, the middle linebacker. Rodgers had a man in his face, but still, there's no excuse for that throw. And now Rutgers will come out. Kalkamakis will take a knee. That's your ball game. The Scarlet Knights win 24-17. A back and forth battle here in the Garden State. Sam Brown, the fifth, your player of the game with 94 rushing yards and a pair of touchdowns. Including the game winner. Ben, Rutgers last year? I think Rutgers was like 5-7 and seven last year. They were not good. But after Washington scored 14 unanswered to take a 17-10 lead, Rutgers scored 14 unanswered to win the game. It's, Rutgers has that habit.com of suddenly playing a really good team really well randomly. I don't know why. Cameron, I have no idea. Sometimes it's because they want it's they want to try and keep the defense off guard. So Rutgers improves the 4 and 0. Oh, looks like the safety does not is not interested. This safety, I should say. 
All right, real quick now, I gotta do the recruiting stuff. It's all is down to the wire, RT. Against good teams, it's always down to the wire. I'm sorry, Cameron. <laughs> So he's not interested in us. Fine. Let's see. Let's see if we can't get this right tackle, Ted Campanaro from Middleton. So far, so good, Howie. So far, so good. Uh, it's all good, RTO. Welcome back. Welcome back. Trying to get some of these guys is not easy. Oh, he's a gem. Okay. Offer scholarship. Oh, this kid was a bust. He get rid of you. Da, 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 da. I'll have to give him a scholarship maybe on next time. All right. Probably Monday, Howie, we'll go back to baseball. We're going to spend the rest of the week doing college football. So, all right. So, trying to trying to get these get kids recruited as now Rutgers will head to Nebraska. By the way, Rutgers now ranked 25th. We're in the top 25 after that win against Washington. Rutgers, ver the Scarlet Knights versus the Corn Huskers. Are you ready? I'm going to try to get three games in today. We'll see how it goes. Rutgers versus Nebraska. Rutgers will receive the opening kickoff, and we are underway. It'll be taken from about the three. Good blocking. Oh, if I had gone left instead of right, maybe. But we'll start our own 22. Kyle Kamakis, you see there, five touchdowns, one interception, one fumble loss, 753 yards on the year so far in four games, which isn't half bad for a team that's very much run first. And already, the stadium is a rockin' here in Nebraska. Hand off to Brown. Blitz runs past him, and he carries two guys to the 30. That's one way to get the crowd out of it, or at least try to. A gain of eight on first down. And another hand off to Brown up the middle. Fighting, fighting, picks up four and moves the chain. So Brown now getting the bulk of the work because of the injury to the number one back for Rutgers. Now another handoff to Brown, and good job shutting the tackle there by number zero, as that will... force Brown down after only a gain of two. Kalkamakis in shotgun. Looking for his tight end underneath. Tuck makes the catch, turns up field, and moves the chains on the crossing pattern. <laughs> Thank you, RTO. Yeah, it is. It is. 
So another good conversion there for Rutgers. As Benjamin now in, spelling Brown. Hand off to him. Hit cuts it back. Little counter route there, and he picks up four. Rutgers now on the Nebraska side of the field. And thank you, uh, England. Much appreciated. Out of the gun. Looking, has a man open downfield. He's found, he's found Kepka the tight end. Konepka the tight end makes the catch. And down to the Nebraska 15. Kyle Kamakis on the run, found his man finally. Oh, he might have been beyond the line of scrimmage. That might, we got lucky there. We got lucky that didn't get called because I almost turned it upfield and just ran. And then I saw Konepka open downfield, like wide open downfield. Hand off to Benjamin now, up the middle. He's got blockers. Touchdown, Scarlet Knights. And Rutgers strikes quickly and strikes first. As the youngsters, ben, the youngster Benjamin finds Bader for the first time this year. Uh, start, yes, David, we'll go back next week and we'll start alternating. Jashawn Benjamin, a sophomore, moving up in the depth chart due to injury. Uh, varsity, Logan. And Patel's extra point is true. It's 7 nothing. Scarlet Knights. This will go to the back of the end zone. It'll be a touchback. Logan, that's what I've heard. That Heisman's impossible. Although... Sneak over here on my Twitch side says as Monogai. I don't know why he's still listed as an impact player. Well, my head's in the way on Twitch. Monogai is hurt. Monogai's hurt for the whole year. He's out. What a shame in his senior season. As a good handoff there. Bouncing it to the outside is the running back. And then a nice job by the safety Dixon to come up and come up and seal the edge. And prevent that from being a big gain. Maybe a gain of one. Almost there, Chase. Almost. Man in motion for Nebraska. They faked the jet sweep. And maybe they should have went with the jet sweep. Because that running play was going nowhere. Where are you going? Nowhere. Third and ten now for the Corn Huskers. Again, out of the gun. Three receivers set. Two to the right, one to the left. And they fake the handoff. And, oh, he finds a soft spot in the zone. Nobody was fooled on the play action on third and ten. But, boy, oh, boy, he finds the soft spot in the zone. And Nebraska converts on third down. Big conversion there. As they're now at their own 47. First and 10. Rutgers blitz. And oh my goodness, the quarterback lucky to get rid of it as he took a pop. Aaron Lewis right in his face. As Rutgers calls up the blitz package. And the defensive end came free. Now delayed handoff. The running back picks up three up the middle. And it'll be third and seven. Again, out of the gun. Right at midfield. Oh, and it's a draw play. And it is going to be close, but just short. He gets, he falls forward for six, but they needed seven. And Nebraska's going to kick it away. So a break for Rutgers as they bend, don't break. And this will fall through the back of the end zone for a touchback. So a net of only 24 on the punt. Good play by Braithwaite to let that drop. And Rutgers now looking to go up by two scores. Three minutes gone here in the first. Head off to Brown. What can Brown do for you? He can get first downs. A gain of 12 on the play. What's up, Bobby? How's it going? Another handoff to Brown. Good block there on the edge. And Brown falls forward for nine. Oh, by the way, where, where? This is for Will, who was on TikTok. 
Fullback has the ball, and that's a bad play. Will's never allowed to call anything ever again. That is the end of Will calling plays. Fullback dive. He got his fullback dive. What's up, Rocco? Loss of one. Hand off to Brown now, and he picks up the first down and moves the chains. What's up, Bobby? Now Benjamin back in there. He got the touchdown. Benjamin, oof. He had a better block there in the edge. Picks up three. No idea what you're talking about, Bobby. Kyle Kamakis in shotgun. Looking to throw. Has a man on the out route. Nice catch and then pushed out of bounds. Good play there by Rutgers as Long makes the catch for 16. So a nice little out route there. And now a handoff to Brown. Up the middle. Breaks one tackle but can't break another. Picks up seven as he falls forward though. I'm liking it a lot, Rocco. Brown averaging seven yards a carry right now. Handoff. Tries to go to the right side, picks up three, and moves the chains. First and ten. And, oh, that's the end of the first quarter. Not enough time to get that playoff uh, yesterday, Patrick. But Rutgers is up 7 nothing. Here in Nebraska. Rutgers dominating the time of possession. First and 10 from the Cornhusker 23. Kalkamakis out of the gun. Looking for a man on the crossing route and he has it. Miller has the catch at the 10 yard line. Now, technically, they can move the chains within the one. So it, or is it for, uh, it's not first and goal, technically. Hand off to Brown up the middle, picks up maybe a yard. Now, now they change the marker. It is, it is second and goal. It is second and goal. That's a little bug. Just a little bug. And it'll be second and goal from the eight. Rutgers now out of the pistol. Uh, yeah, Rocco, I root for Rutgers. Hand off to Brown up the middle. Down to the two. They move him actually, they mark him actually at the four. I thought he got more than that, but. Another hand off to Brown. Up the middle. Touchdown, Rutgers. He spins off of a tackler and falls for pay dirt. Bobby, you're going to be timed out because you're asking just gibberish. The extra point is true, and Rutgers has come to Nebraska and punched the Corn Huskers in the mouth twice. It's 14 0. Taken out of the end zone, even though it was a yard deep. Good coverage. Nebraska will start at their own 18. Rocco, I have no idea. He's some dude on Twitch. I don't know. He's very, he's very annoying. So I gave, he's, he's, he's not saying anything bad necessarily. So he gets a timeout, not a block. I formation for Nebraska. And oh my goodness. He, the running back just got flattened by Do Dowdell. Or excuse me, that's uh, the running back for... That's the running back who got flattened on that play. Um, and it's no gain. Maybe a gain of a yard. I think he fell forward for maybe a yard. Nebraska out of shotgun. Handoff up the middle. Good blocking up front. And Dowdell falls forward for seven. Uh, for a couple of months, Logan. Yeah, I think so, at least. I formation for Nebraska. Rutgers sends the house, and Dowdell will fall forward for three and a first down. Just able to beat the blitz. 
And now a jumbo eye formation again for Nebraska. And again, Rutgers sends the house. And a good job sealing the edge there. No gain on the play. Aaron Garland, the outside linebacker with the tackle. And now an empty backfield for Nebraska. 3.15 left in the half. 14-0 Rutgers. And oh, and the quarterback's going to keep it himself, and that was a mistake. That's a loss of a yard on the play. And it's third and 11. Rutgers, that defensive line is stout. And now it looks like there's, yes, the screen pass. But Dowdell is only going to pick up five as it's well covered in the flat by the corner. And Nebraska moves the chains a little bit again, but has forced to punt once more. Good kick by the kick, the punter. Taken at the 20. Braithwaite quickly spun down at the 22. So first and 10, Scarlet Knights, 245 left in the half. Hand off to Brown, who gets backed up and loses four on the play. All right, here we go. 210 left in the half. Rutgers in shotgun. Play action to Brown. And throwing into double coverage, but oh, he got his tips on it. He went up for it, but could not come down with it. Very aggressive try on the catch, but a good job there by Nebraska. And it'll be third and 14 as they try to stop Rutgers for the first time today. That was Long who went up for it. And now looking for Dremel underneath. He'll make the catch. But it's a short gain of only of about four. And Rutgers will be forced to punt. Actually a gain of five officially. And a good kick. And a fair catch called for at the Nebraska 35. So both teams exchanged punts on their previous possessions, and now Nebraska with three timeouts going to try to put points on the board before the half. They do get the ball to start the second half. Rutgers rushes four. Pass is picked off! It's picked off! He jumped the route, and there he goes! Taunting into the end zone, Eric Rodgers with the pick six! And even when the offense doesn't score, the defense picks up the slack. And this is turning into a blowout. It's 20 to nothing, Scarlet Knights. Nebraska had their chance. They finally get a stop on defense. And then Rutgers is like, whoop. So Nebraska, who's also 4-1, and one, by the way. Getting spanked by the Scarlet Knights as the kickoff now will go a yard deep into the end zone and Nebraska will take it out and then a big hit and they'll start their own 13. I don't know, uh, Blackheart, I don't know. Uh, varsity, Rocco, but if you saw the last two games against Virginia Tech and Washington that came down to like the final possession, you'll see that it's just that Nebraska's really not that good. As a good tackle there. And the receiver stays in bounds. But second and four as Nebraska picks up six. Pocket collapsing. Pass caught in the flat, and the receiver will get out of bounds. That'll stop the clock as Nebraska moves the chains. Thomas Fadone the second. Nebraska again in shotgun. And again, oh, almost picked off for the second time. They might want to stop testing Eric Rodgers. If his hands were better, that might have been another pick. A buck 22 left here in the first half. 21 nothing Rutgers. And a good catch there by the tight end, I believe. But it's a gain of only about seven. 
six officially. Nebraska at their own 30 as they use their first timeout. Third and four. Rutgers sends four. Decent pocket, good post pattern, and the receiver breaks a tackle, and there he goes! And Nebraska comes back. Boy, did they need that. I don't think so, RTO. I don't think so. A broken tackle on a post pattern, and then off to the races. Nebraska's on the board, and Rutgers' lead is now 14. Remember, the Cornhuskers get the ball to start the second half, so they needed that. We'll see if Rutgers plays it conservatively, as Benjamin will take the kickoff and take a knee, or if they'll try to put points up again before the half comes to an end. They have all three of their timeouts. From their own 25. Minute eight left of the first half, 21-7 Scarlet Knights. And Kyle Kamakis will dump it off over underneath, underneath. And it'll be second and one. Less than a minute to go. Rutgers conserving their timeouts. Out of the shotgun. Man in motion. Kyle Kamakis takes the snap. Looking for Kep Kanepka, the tight end, and it's knocked away. Third and one coming up from the, your own 34. Nebraska looking for a stop. Hand off to Brown. Brown with room, little room to run. Picks up the first down, and Rutgers will use their first timeout. Kala, Kala, Amak, Kala, Ak, Kala Akmanis. Yes, I'm not going to lie. I can't wait for some of these guys to graduate. <laughs> oh, goodness. Kala, Amak, Kala Akmanis. Kala Akmanis in shotgun. Back to pass. Has a man, and he, oh, he hit him in stride. Another first down for the Scarlet Knights. That's Miller again. And now Kala, Amak, Kala, Amak, Kala Akmanis is over 100 yards passing today. Thirty-nine seconds left in the half. Rutgers at the Nebraska forty-eight, and he's going to go underneath. Good catch by Long, and Rutgers now going to hurry it up. Gain of six. Play action, and Kalakmanis on the run has a man, and there's a flag on the play. I think it's going to be holding or a man downfield. It's coming back. Yep, illegal man downfield, I believe, or no, illegal touching. No, it's on us. Yeah, it is illegal. It's offensive pass interference, basically. Well, that's a rough break. Basically a loss of down. But third and four coming up. 20 seconds left in the half. Should have just scrambled. Should have just scrambled. The reason why it was illegal touching is that he thought I was going to scramble and then went back to block. And then he's like, oh, no, he's throwing the ball. Oh, no. Pass underneath is caught and turning up field and making the catch. But Rutgers has to use their last time out. What's up, Bobby? Yeah. So 14 seconds left from the Nebraska 37. It's fine, Bobby. Just relax, man. I think it's very good sports guy, yeah. Rutgers in shotgun. Going deep. In the double coverage. Oh, and it almost deflects to the Rutgers receiver. Well, again, we're too far away for a field goal. So we need either a crossing route or a deep route. Then get out of bounds quickly. And passes underneath, and he was hit as he throws. So basically going to throw it up to the end zone now. Kala Akmanis in shotgun. Here's the snap. Last play of the half. And he chucks it up. Back of the end zone. And out of the end zone. So the end of the first half. All right, and now, Bobby, you're banned. Bye-bye, Bobby. Bye-bye.
I gave you a chance. I only timed you out. You're gone now. See ya. Player of the first half, Sam Brown the fifth. 63 yards and a touchdown. We go to the second half. Rutgers up by 14. Uh, yes, yeah, sports guy. We're gonna go back to baseball next week. We'll go and then we'll alternate. And this one is gonna be booted to the back of the end zone, and it'll be a touchback. So Nebraska will start at their own twenty-five. Matt, it's very good. It's in particular, I really enjoy the recruiting process. Although it's uh, that's kind of like on extra hard difficulty with Rutgers. I've only recruited one guy so far. Out of the gun, draw play. Oh, what a play by Malcolm Ray to shed the tack the uh, the blocker and makes a play after only a one yard gain. Nobody fooled. And second and nine coming up for Nebraska. Again, if it wasn't for that home run play. It, Rutgers would be in, have a stranglehold on this game as now the quarterback going to try to keep it himself and he's going to lose six as Rutgers sent the house Moses Walker with the sack or tackle for a loss actually but still you know what I mean technically it's not a sack because it was a run play but third and 15 and a screen play is set up good blocking but they're only going to get nine when they needed 15. And Nebraska takes the opening kick, uh, second half kickoff. Takes the ki opening kickoff. Takes this kick. Holy cow. I'm glitching right now, folks. Takes the kickoff for the second half and goes three and out. As that's going to be caught by Braithwaite. And he'll step out of bounds at the 40. Whew. I, I am totally glitching today. Hand off to Brown. Has good blocking. Up the middle. Shakes one tackler and falls forward for eight. Sammy Brown, the fifth. Because, Xavier, it's not that easy. As Brown up the middle picks up another first down. And, oh, no. On back-to-back -back weeks, Rutgers' running backs have gotten hurt. Sammy Brown, the fifth, is hurt holding his ribs. And the Rutgers Nation can't believe it. They're running out of tailbacks. Benjamin comes in. He, he had a few carries earlier and gets stuffed here at the 46. It's a loss of two. Fortunately, it looks like Brown will probably just miss the rest of the game, maybe. I'm okay, RTO. I'm all right, buddy. I'm hanging in there. So second and 12 coming up for Rutgers. Kalak Manis in shotgun. Dumps it off underneath. Nice crossing route to Miller, who gets 13 and another first down. Miller's fifth catch of the day now has 56 yards, a little more than his average. Xavier, you know of any job openings? Hand off to Benjamin. Up the middle. Gets some good blocks. And now an injury for Robinson of Nebraska as Benjamin picks up eight. And now Brown back in there. Good to see. I guess they taped them up. Hey, taped those ribs up real good. And be first and 10 from the Nebraska 18. Kyle Kamanis goes back to pass. Looking for Brown. Corner of the end zone. Touchdown! Rutgers! Brown, his first receiving touchdown of the year. He drifted out towards the sideline and was left wide open and then tiptoes into the corner of the end zone. Touchdown, Scarlet Knights, for the junior, Sammy Brown, the fifth.
Patel puts the extra point through, and it's 28-7, Scarlet Knights. And the kickoff, again, will go to the back of the end zone. Lloyd will take a knee. And again, Nebraska will start at their own 25. This has been by far our, I would say, probably, against in terms of real competition, our most, most dominating start, right? Needed to come back against Virginia Tech. It came down to the absolute wire against Washington. But Nebraska has put up no fight today here against Rutgers. As the pocket collapses, what a swim move. Big ol' sack for the big fella, Griffin. And it's a five-yard loss. Rutgers clicking right now on all cylinders. Keyshawn Griffin, his first sack, I think, of the year. Having a real nice day. As we're under two and a half left in the third. And the pass will be caught in the flat. Oh, good tackle there. Long beam, what a tackle. As he comes up and wraps up the receiver after only a gain of five. Again, out of the shotgun. Pocket holding, at least for the time. Quick pass, the tight end, I believe, or the backup running back. Able to pick up 11. Now that is the tight end. Fadone, his third catch of the day. Yeah, big guy sack, RTO. The big fella. As this one caught down low and the receiver tries to get almost tripped up and then finally taken down after a gain of six. Second and four, Nebraska moving the ball down 21 to seven. A minute 40 left in the third. Man in motion. Oh, it's the end of the round as Rutgers blitzed. And that's gonna allow the receiver to get the edge and pick up a few yards. And move the chains. Nebraska now on the Rutgers side of the field. Man in motion. Rutgers blitzes again. And oh my goodness. Oh, he almost had it picked off by the defensive lineman. As the quarterback. Oh, he got hit by that blitz fast. Hard and fast. Rutgers sends, to, sends two. Nebraska can't pick it up. Second and ten. And now a handoff. And again, the Rutgers run blitz really shuts it down. It's going to be third and eight. Again, Nebraska, Chris, thank you for the follow. Again, Nebraska in shotgun. Rutgers sends only four this time. This one caught, caught near the sideline and pushed out of bounds. Nice little out route there to move the chains. And Nebraska, again, converts on third down. It's a big third down conversion. But they're still down by three touchdowns with a minute left in the third. I formation for the Cornhuskers. Hand off to the left side. Good tackle by the linebacker. And it's only a gain of four as Dodell... Held the 20 yards today at 115 last game. And Rutgers is holding him to less to about to about two yards a carry. That's right. Hashtag chalk Cole. Absolutely. And so good job on the blitz pickup. And that's gonna be a touchdown on the post pattern. Touchdown, Corn Huskers. Rutgers got fooled by the play action. Nebraska takes advantage. And it's, they, got a, they still got a high, a big mountain to climb, but they've gotten closer. It's 28-13. What's up, Marley? How's it going? Lloyd with the touchdown catch. And the extra point for the Cornhuskers is good. It's a two-touchdown game again. As the Cornhuskers go 76 yards in 10 plays. And they answer the Rutgers touchdown. Braith White will take the kick from the three. He's got, oh man, if 20, if Brown made a better block, I get his ribs are hurting. If he made a better block, that might have been a kick, uh, a touchdown. He might have returned that kick for a touchdown. So 40 seconds left here in the third quarter. Brown back in there. Taped up. 
Hand off to Brown, going to the right side, picks up maybe a half yard. And Rutgers is going to let this run down to the fourth quarter. Second and ten coming up when we come back. But at the end of three quarters of play here in Omaha, it's 28-14 Rutgers. As we look here at the top 25, Rutgers has cracked the top 25 after that big upset win of Washington last week. So second and 10 coming up for the Scarlet Knights, up 28 to 14. And a handoff to Brown as he'll pick up three, almost four. And it'll be third and seven. Rutgers eating up the clock. 420, smoke him if you got him. Play action, nobody fooled. And down goes Kalamakis. As Bullock gets the sack. The only thing is, is that keeps the clock running. Rutgers obviously gonna punt it away. I'm just gonna let the clock run. Four minutes left here in the fourth. Probably not gonna kick it to about 345. And this is part of the game, is let, let the clock just keep on running. And a good kick by the Rutgers punter. Back to about the Nebraska 40, and then a good tackle right at midfield. Almost out kicked his coverage, but not quite. So Nebraska with a short field after they force a three and out. Only the second time today they forced Rutgers to go three and out. Empty backfield, Nebraska in shotgun. Rutgers rushes four, catches made, but only a gain of six. And now Nebraska, knowing the clock is not their friend, goes into hurry up. Second and four. Audible at the line. Pass is caught, but only for a one yard gain. So third and three coming up. Almost would have been better off dropping the ball and saving the time. And the pass caught over the middle. It'll be a first down and it'll move the chains. As Isaiah Nayer makes his third catch, catch of the day. 81 yards and a touchdown for Nayer as he'll miss a couple plays. He got a little shaken up there. That'll stop the clock. A fortunate break for Nebraska. And the pass is caught, but again in, inbounds in the flat. And it'll be second and four. Again, out of the gun. Less than three minutes to go. Rutgers sends the blitz. The catch is made. The running back pushed out of bounds. First and 10 from the 24. 250 left here in the fourth. Pass is caught after a five-yard pickup. And again, here comes Nebraska hurrying up. Again, the clock is against them. 240 left. Trips to the left side now. 235. As that pass is going to be caught. Good gain there for 19. It's first and goal. With less than two and a half to go. I think so, Matt. I think so. Again, out of the gun. And finally throwing it away is the quarterback for Nebraska, Rayola. Two seventeen left in the fourth. 28-14 Rutgers trying to hold on here. As down, oh, Rayola hit as he throws and gets it out of the back of the end zone. He almost went down there. He got lucky. Rutgers gave him a little different look and it definitely threw him for a loop. So get third and goal now from the six, from shotgun. Nebraska can't settle for a field goal here. Good pocket, dumps it off to the side, but the running back steps out of bounds. And it'll be fourth and goal from the two. 
What you gonna do? This is likely the ball game. 208 left. I formation for Nebraska. It's a pitch to the outside. Oh, and he broke a tackle. The running back was in, was dead to rights in the backfield, but he shook out of the tackle and finds pay dirt. And Nebraska's made yeah, it a one score game as Dodell gets pay dirt here late in the fourth. Dodell's had a terrible day on the ground, but when they needed him the most, he picks up the two biggest yards of the game thus far for Nebraska. And Nebraska will kick it away with three timeouts and the two-minute warning as it'll be a touchback. Well, here's the, here's the situation, folks. Classic football. Rutgers needs a couple of first downs, and the game is over. Nebraska makes a stand. They'll have a chance to tie. Hand off to Brown. Up the middle. He's got blockers and picks up nine as we hit the two-minute warning. And Brown comes out of the game and in comes Benjamin trying to save Brown from possibly injuring his ribs more. Hand off to Benjamin. There goes Benjamin to the outside. There goes Benjamin. Benjamin breaks one. Benjamin into Nebraska territory. And Nebraska has to start using their timeouts as the sophomore. Benjamin breaks one. Hand off again to Benjamin. Up the middle he goes. Another first down and another timeout used by Nebraska. And another handoff to Benjamin up the middle. And the last time, I would say Rutgers, Xavier. So second and five. And a handoff up the middle. Benjamin going to be close. It's going to be third and one. Rutgers letting the clock run. It is. Uh, I don't know if it's on Xbox One, Zeke. I know it's on Xbox Series X. And the QB can't get it. He can't get it. So Rutgers will come up to the line... They need inches. A first down game is over. The reason why Patel has missed almost everything he kicks. I mean, it is what it is, Xavier. Patel is one of the worst kickers in college football. So Rutgers, instead of taking the three that would ice the game, are going to go for the first down that would also ice the game. And they get it. They give him the spot. They give him the spot. That's the game. Rutgers will hold on. That's your ball game. As the clock will run out and Rutgers holds on 28-21. As they successfully run the clock out here in the fourth. Who wants to see one more? Yeah, I think so too, Jeffrey. I thought it was short also. I'm not going to lie. I thought it was short. <laughs> I'm going to run a commercial. Who wants to see one more? All right. We see. It looks like one more. One more. Yeah, one more. All right, we're going to do one more. So really the difference in the game was the one turnover, the pick six that we had. Nebraska falls to four and two. Rutgers improves to five, an unlikely five and oh.
And obviously, the more we win, the more it's going to be easier to recruit guys. So Rutgers moves up to 21 in the nation. So we go to recruiting. Oh, he's a gem, too. Well, for scholarship. Add action. We want to try and get into that top spot as quickly as possible. I would say, I wouldn't say so, Xavier. Yeah, round to the wire, RTO. That was a completely different, again, in the one score game, completely different finish than anything else, but right down to the wire. Probably not going to get this kid, but we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. Well, Joey, because now college football came out. We're going to go back to baseball next week and start ro rotating, but it's a brand new game. So, all right. So, we did our recruiting exercises for this week. Or, yeah, like how close are we? Like, it looks, this kid Cornell, he's, the visit might be what puts him over the top to be our new quarterback in the future. Um, we're trying to climb the ranks with Emery. This kid Cherry, we're at near the top. Figueroa, like we're 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 with the front runners for some of these guys, but it's just it's gotta take it's gonna take time. It's gonna take time. Probably gonna lose this kid to Syracuse. Womp womp. Um, but we're we're in the lead for a lot of the guys we've been targeting, and we're we're getting on the uh, the board for other guys. So we'll see what happens. Um. Anyway, Wisconsin versus Rutgers. This is a massive game. 19 Wisconsin, 21 Rutgers. Rutgers 5-0, Wisconsin 4-1. Scarlet Knights versus the Badgers. Third and final game of the day, because after this, I, I do have to go. But we're back in the birthplace of college football. New Jersey. The SHI Stadium. As Rutgers takes the field. Looking to continue their improbable undefeated run. We've got ourselves. This is a this is one of the games of the week, ladies and gentlemen. 21 Rutgers versus 19 Wisconsin. Rutgers will get the ball to start. And the Badgers send it away. It's a mediocre kick. Braithwaite will take it from the three. Looking for blockers. Doesn't really get many, but falls forward to 22. So solid starting field position. As we look at Christian Dremel, who has not had a great year here in his senior year. Only five catches. A couple of drops. Of course, though, a lot of it has just been the fact that uh, other guys have stepped up. If you get open, I'll get you the ball. Sammy Brown, the fifth, gets the ball and falls forward for about three. So on first down, Rutgers, not, not surprising. They run the ball. It's what they do. So second and seven for the Scarlet Knights at their own 25. Out of the gun. And Kinepkinepka, Kine I can never say his name. <laughs> Especially now that everybody's gotten me self-conscious about how I was saying it earlier. <laughs> Pass is incomplete as they got a hand on it. Needed one more second, maybe, to get rid of that. 
or excuse me, uh, Kala Akmanis is the quarterback. Konepka, of course, the, the tight end. And he's the tight end. Konepka's open. He's wide open. It's a gain of 17 and a first down. So big third down conversion there for Rutgers. They needed seven, they got 17. And Kyle Kamanis now hands it off to Benjamin up the middle. Oh, and Benjamin pinballing his way through the line. Big gain there for the sophomore, Deshaun Benjamin. With Brown nursing injured ribs, you're gonna see a lot more of a 50-50 workload this week. Thank you for the share, JF1. Hand off again to Benjamin, again cuts it back. This time he gets stuffed after only a two yard gain. And it'll be second and eight. Kalak, Kalak Manis. Kalak Manis in shotgun. Trips to the left. Play action to Benjamin. Looking for and has a man wide open. Touchdown, Rutgers! Big play to Long, Chris Long. Oh, my goodness. A 57-yard touchdown. Wide open on the post pattern. And Rutgers strikes first. Easily their biggest play of the year, 57 yards. As the senior, Chris Long, makes a statement here early. Just finds the soft spot in the zone, and Kalak Manis feeds him a perfect bullet. And the extra point by Patel is good. Thank you, JF1. So the Scarlet Knights take the opening kickoff and score in a minute and a half. The big play, the 57-yard bomb to Chris Long. As this will be a touchback. And again, just like last week against Nebraska, Rutgers gets off to a fast start. Again, you see there the impact players. Monagai, unfortunately, is hurt for the entire year. He tore his pec two weeks ago is also why Brown and Benjamin are now the running backs. Wisconsin in shotgun. And oh, it's a draw play. Oh, and boy, oh boy, Rutgers is not looking for the draw play. As that is a 14-yard gain on first down. Again, in shotgun, four receivers set. And the ball, oh, the blitz is going to get there. This time Rutgers sends the house and Keyshawn Griffin gets his second sack of the year. The big fella breaking through and it's a seven yard loss. Big play by that Rutgers front. Ah, oh, look at the big fella feasting there on the quarterback. Second and 17 now. SHI Stadium is shaking. And a handoff and cutting it back on the counter play is the running back. He'll pick up four. What's up, Antelope? How's it going? Soy, I'm enjoying it. Very much so. Ches Malusi, Malusi the running back. Elusive Malusi picks up four. He had 35 yards in his last game. He's usually the spell back. It's better than Madden Antelope. The presentation's better as... And yes, a little screen pass. Oh, and a bad play. The running back, instead of bouncing it outside, cuts it back in. If that if he goes the other, if he goes left instead of right, he's got a first down. As Van Dyke feeds him the ball, but Wisconsin, their drive stalls, and they'll have to kick it away back to Rutgers. Varsity, Mario. Big play for the big guy. Exactly, RTO. Presentation's better. Um, I would say, and I, I love the recruitment mini game between every week to week. And Braithwaite will take a fair catch at the 18 yard line. Thought about returning it, but instead decides to fair catch it. And Rutgers has the ball back. Basically, you got to go player to player, and you got to like, you got there's different. You have so many hours, and you have to spend hours week to week trying to convince guys to come play for your school next year. That's a three-yard gain by Brown, his second carry of the day. And now another handoff to Brown. Again, up the middle, picks up two, and it's going to be third and five. 
So third and five from the Rutgers 23. I mean, you could antelope, but I'm not going to. Out of the gun. And has a man underneath. That's Miller showing off the wheels, turning up field on the crossing pattern. And it's another Rutgers first down. First and 10 now from their own 34. Kalkamakis on a shotgun, has Dremel over the middle, shakes a tackle, and picks up 12. And so Rutgers again moving the chains. And again, Kalkamakis out of shotgun. And again has Miller on a crossing route, turning up field. As Rutgers dinking and dunking their way down the field. And it's another first down. Kalkamanis going deep and it's gonna be picked off. He underthrew his receiver. Bad turnover there by the Rutgers quarterback. Only his second pick of the year. I tried to take control of the receiver but it was too late. His momentum was taking him past where the ball was going. So a bad mistake there while Rutgers is driving. And a big break for Wisconsin. Five minutes, Antelope, five minutes. Less than a minute to go. Handoff, oh, good cut back there by the, oh, the, what are the moves? Look at the moves! What moves by the running back, White, and there he goes! 75 yards to Pater! Pinballing his way through the Rutgers line, and suddenly, Two plays, and this game is turned on its head. A home run run for White as he goes the distance. And the Rutgers faithful are stunned. As someone said earlier, you can hear a pin drop in Piscataway. Benjamin will take the kickoff from the four. Looking for blockers and gets it back to the 21. Well, that's my fault. I got cocky. I'm a run first kind of guy and then I'm like, I'm just going to keep passing. Hand off to Brown. Brown up the middle. Brown's got a hole you could drive a truck through and picks up 21. Sammy Brown. Nice quality run there. The safety... Well, that's why he's called a safety. Saved their bacon there as Brown again up the middle picks up four. Well, maybe three. It was whatever, just like always, Antelope. Kyle Kamakis got greedy. He went for the home run ball. It got picked off. And then the first play from scrimmage, the Badgers hit themselves a home run. As this one dropped off underneath, Nice juke, shakes one tackle, and Miller is pushed out of bounds as the first quarter ends. But Rutgers again, back to the Wisconsin 38, tied at seven. Raw was very good. As predicted, they opened with the Mommy and Dominic segment. It was very funny. And then Sam, and then Braun Strowman and, and Sami Zayn continued to feud. Uh, they put Ilya Dragunov into a match with Sami and... Uh, Braun broke it up. First and ten for the for the Scarlet Knights. Hand off to Brown up the middle. Picks up seven, eight, maybe nine. I don't know, Grant. I don't know off. I don't know offhand. As this one hands off to Brown and Brown stuffed at the line of scrimmage. So third and one for Rutgers now at the Wisconsin 29. Hand off again to Brown. He'll pick up the first down this time. Kalkamanis in shotgun. Has a man, nice seam route there for Miller. And it's first and goal, Scarlet Knights. 
A quick 20-yard gain on the seam route. Now a handoff to Brown. Brown bouncing off of tacklers, picks up four, and down about the five. Second and goal from the six. Another handoff to Brown, bouncing it outside, and forced all the way out to strung it out to about the four. Third and goal from the four. Play action to Brown. And looking, oh, and what a terrible turnover. Looking for Konepka in the back of the end zone and it's picked off. Interceptions in the end zone on back-to-back -back drives. And the magic start for the Rutgers season may be running out as the clock struck midnight here in Piscataway. Well, at least a good tackle there by the big fella, Hamilton, laying down, laying out the running back, and he is slow to get up after a three-yard loss. Can the Rutgers defense step up after their quarterback having a real bad day here? And now a quick slant route. Good tackle, but it's a first down. Wisconsin gets the ball to start the game. Uh, start the second half, excuse me. Another good run, gain of five, as Nate White has been a monster today. Still tied at seven, but Wisconsin winning the turnover battle uh, two to nothing. As that is picked off, Rutgers returns the favor! Huge play there for Rutgers on the slant route. And suddenly it's a two to one turnover battle as Bo Masco makes the pick. And Brown gets blown up in the backfield second and 12. Grapes, thank you for the follow. Second and 12 from the Nebraska, or excuse me, the Wisconsin 42. Nebraska was last week. Out of the gun. Has Kepka the tight end underneath. He'll pick up 11, and he'll make it third and one. Hand off to Brown. Up the middle. He's got plenty of running room. He'll move the chains. And Rutgers going to try to get one more playoff before the two-minute warning. And they do. Looking for the man underneath the crossing route. That's Miller. He's been all over the ball today. Picks up eight, maybe nine as we hit the two-minute warning. What do you mean, 14? It's college football. It's the same as yesterday. As this one hands off to Brown. Brown bounces it outside. Tries to make a juke move. But it'll be first and goal. From the seven. Kalkamanis out of shotgun. Oh no, bad pass. Oh, and the the linebacker dropped it. I knew it as soon as I let go of the ball. I missed where the guy was. And he dropped it. And Kalkamanis exhales as it's been down here around the end zone. That he's really struggled. And this time he finds his man. Chris Long. Touchdown, Rutgers. Still go, go good 14, but yeah, we're it's, it's college football now. So Rutgers capitalizes on their turnover force. Wisconsin capitalized on one of the two they forced. And now Kyle Kamakis has two touchdowns to go with two picks today. And the extra point by Patel is good. It's 14-7. Scarlet Knights late in the first half. Yeah, I usually just go, touchdown, Scarlet Knights, Antelope. But I don't do it every time, as that's going to be taken at the goal line, the ensuing kickoff. And oh my goodness, he should have taken a touchback. Wisconsin is going to start at their own six. Holy cow. That was a terrible play. Van Dyke now in shotgun. 
Rutgers sends the house. And a quick slant route. Good play. Good tackle. But now out of the shadow of their own end zone is Wisconsin as they'll have the ball at their own 21 now. Pocket starting to collapse and that's batted down. Good play there by the corner in the zone. So second and 10 coming up. Rutgers wanting to hold Wisconsin here since they get the ball to start the second half. Van Dyke again in shotgun. Pass is caught over the middle. Big tackle, though, immediately. Gain of six. Third and four. Van Dyke again in shotgun. And they fake the handoff. And Van Dyke hit as he throws, but he finds a man and he steps out of bounds. The zone collapsed at the last second. And now Wisconsin has the ball at midfield. Van Dyke with a man in his face finds his receiver. And he does it again. Good tackle, but... Wisconsin moving the ball as they'll use their first time out now with 56 seconds left in the half. Van Dyke in shotgun. Three receivers set. Rutgers sends the blitz. It's picked up. And it's batted away. Good play by the corner there. So Rutgers sent the blitz. He did not get home, but fortunately no harm, no foul. Van Dyke again in shotgun. Again, a three receiver set. This time the running back to his right. Good pocket, has a man over the middle. That's the running back White, picks up 14. And it'll be first and 10 from the Rutgers 16 yard line. And this is going to be knocked away. Almost picked off. Good job by the corner there to bat that ball down. Van Dyke hit as he throws and almost picked off again. So third and ten. It'd be a moral victory if Rutgers can hold them to a field goal attempt here. The line collapsing. Van Dyke hit as he throws, and he throws it through the back of the end zone. So Wisconsin will try for three. And the kick is up and good from 34 yards away. Uh, 24 17, and Jay, yeah, came down to the wire. Had to make a defensive stand to stop him from tying it. So, Wisconsin, with 25 seconds left in the half, will kick it back to Rutgers. There'll be a touchback. And then we beat Nebraska 28-21. Kalkamakis in shotgun. Play action to Brown. Looking for somebody. Bad pass. Oh, no, it's a great pass. I thought that was going to go right to the linebacker again, but it was just beyond his fingertips. Rutgers uses a timeout. Big gainer. A gain of 22. Yes, last game of the day, NJ. And again, out of shotgun now. And again, looking for Konepka knocked away. Rutgers realistically does need about, oh, you know, 30 yards or so to give Patel a real decent shot. And looking for Konepka again knocked away. Yeah, he's hurt. He tore his peck in the third game. Uh, he tore his, tore his peck. Against Washington, he's out for the year. He's out for the year, user. So that's it. His Rutgers career is over. RTO gets a hydrate. Looking for Konepka again. This time he makes the catch. Rutgers with the quick timeout. Oof. Ugh. I really would have loved, like... Two more yards. 
And here's Patel, the worst kicker in college football. And it is, he had the distance and he shanked it to the left. We go into the second half. Rutgers up by four. He had the distance. He either has the, it's hard. You either get the distance or the accuracy. So Patel now one for five on field goal attempts this year. And Jay, I, I don't know. He was just like, I kicked the ball really well. Yeah, but you pulled it to the left. You had the you had the strength. But that's the other thing. I would have loved time for one more play, not just to get closer, but also to center the ball uh, more. What 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 David? What's the question? So again, the big play. Each team has scored seven off of a turnover. Rutgers has turned it over twice. Wisconsin once. A missed field goal again for Rutgers at the end of the half. Has you... That may... Oh, maybe, David, maybe. This is only game number six. So Patel will send it deep. This will be taken by Williams at the goal line. And he gets a pretty good return. Gets it back to the 21 after being spun down there. Van Dyke in shotgun. Wisconsin with the ball. 14-10 Rutgers. Oh, and there he goes. Missed tackle, and Williams, he gets slowed down. But a big 22-yard gain on first down. It's Malusi there. He's been hit. He's been a home run swinger. Honestly, the running game today for Wisconsin has been fantastic. Win, it's been great so far. Van Dyke in shotgun. Three receivers set. Now everybody calling audibles. And a handoff, and this time he goes nowhere. Gain a one. Good job there by the defensive end to take down Malusi. Fourteen ten Rutgers. Van Dyke in shotgun. And again, Malusi up the middle, and again only gains one. Third and eight from the Wisconsin 45. Uh, I only got one guy so far, DL, but I'll, there's a lot of guys who are close. I think if we win this game, I think there's going to be a couple of guys who sign with us. Is this one? Nice catch there by Pauling. Tight window, but he finds a way. And it'll be first and 10 at the Rutgers 37. Van Dyke in shotgun. Man in motion. They fake the jet sweep. Here's the blitz. And Van Dyke hit as he throws. He's lucky he got rid of that ball. The blitz got home. Yeah, DL. It is, it's very hard to get signings before like weeks seven and eight and stuff. Van Dyke again in shotgun. Rutgers sends four this time. This one caught. Oh, good slant or more post pattern. And what Wisconsin again back in field goal range. Rutgers again trying to bend but not break just like at the end of the half. Van Dyke in shotgun. Hand off to White who had that big home run run earlier. Picks up 12. And it'll be first and goal. White now over 100 yards on the day. Van Dyke again in shotgun. And again, they hand it off. Good blocking. And White will dance in for Pater for the second time today. So again, that missed field goal by Rutgers looming large as Wisconsin takes their first lead. And with the extra point, it's now 17-14 Badgers. And the ensuing kickoff. This will be a touchback. Again, Rutgers, if they didn't have those two turnovers, they could be up by 11. Instead, they're down by three as Brown gets blown up in the backfield again. 
Good run blitz by the Badgers. And it's second and 13. Kyle Kamanis under center. Play action pass. Looking for, and he's just going to take it himself. Looking for blockers. Pushed out of bounds after a seven yard pickup. Eh, not a bad play. And it'll be third and four. Again, play action. Look, looking underneath, and it's Brown who makes the catch for a gain of five, maybe six. And that'll move the chains. Rutgers looking to respond. Have had trouble, aside from the one turnover, stopping Wisconsin today. And a big handoff to Brown up the middle, picks up seven. Good blocking up front by the big fellas. Seventeen fourteen, Wisconsin. Hand off again to Brown up the middle. Falls forward, and Brown is hurt. And I think he's holding his ribs again. It's very good, Todd. As it'll be third and inches. And Kyle Kamakis will just dive forward and moves the chains. And Brown is out for the rest of the ball game with a bruised sternum. First down, Rutgers, though, at their own 49. Hand off to Benjamin, the sophomore, who's had a very good couple of games after the injury to uh, Monagai and picks up maybe a yard here. I would say so, Todd, yeah. Second and 10 from around midfield. Kyle Kamanis in shotgun. And he's going to go down. He's, he drifted right into the blitz. Bad break there for Rutgers as it's going to be third and 20 now. Third and forever. And now play action. And Kalkaman is hit as he throws. He had a man downfield, but the blitz got home no time. And the punt is away. It's a pretty good one. Catch is made, though. He slips out of one tackle, but not two. And Wisconsin will start at their own 28. So the drive stalls around midfield for Rutgers. Good pressure there by Wisconsin. And now, oh, good run blocking. And a gain of nine on first down. By Malusi. And they fake it. The QB keeps it. And he's going nowhere. Lewis there with the sack. Well, the tackle, not a sack, but because it was a run, it was a designed run. But it's third and four now after a three and a half yard loss. Rutgers brought the house and it worked. And Van Dyne has a man in the flat and that's gonna be a first down and then some. And again, the Rutgers tackling today has been poor and that is a big reason why they are losing this game right now. And down goes Van Dyke as he gets rid of it. The screen was blown up before it even got started. Good play by Lewis there. And now Van Dyne, Van Dyke in shotgun. Pass to the flat, again caught. The receiver down after a gain of 11 and a first down. First and 10. Got to try to hold to a field goal attempt here. Hand off to the left side. Good blocking. But Malusi only picks up three. Uh, next week, Gio. We're back to baseball next week. Second and seven. And again, good coverage there on the end. They are in field goal range, Wisconsin. But it's... Might be the last play of the third quarter. Oh, and they hand it off. 
And the running back doesn't get there. White taken down by, I believe that's Powell. And it's going to be fourth and one. This is a massive decision here now for Wisconsin. And they're going to settle for the attempt at three. This will be a 41, 40 to 41 yard field goal. The kick is up and it is good, but it's a six point game. So again, the Rutgers defense bends, but does not break. As we get the fourth quarter started, Braithwaite takes it from the five, looking for blockers, tries to cut and turn up field, taken down at the 23. Now a handoff to Benjamin, up the middle, down at the 28-yard line. Benjamin had a big run earlier. Another handoff to him, again looking for blockers. Picks up maybe three. You'll see, RTO, we'll see. Third and two. And Benjamin is blown, it's blown up in the backfield. Three straight runs. And oh goodness, what do you do now? Rutgers is going to go for it. Out of the shotgun. And Kalkamanis, he's got all kinds of room. That's a smart play by the quarterback as he gets the first down on fourth down. Absolutely, Todd. Big conversion there for Rutgers. Now a handoff to Benjamin up the middle. Picks up five. Kalkamanis again in shotgun. Play action to the third running back. And Dremel finds a soft spot and makes the catch. First down, Rutgers. Slowly but surely marching down the field. Another handoff to Benjamin, up the middle, spins out of one tackle, and falls forward for about nine. Second and one from the Wisconsin 33. Handoff to Benjamin, he'll fall forward for one, and that's enough for a first down. Three minutes to go. Rutgers a long, methodical drive. Hand off to Benjamin. Has a couple of blockers. Picks up three, maybe four. Probably not as good as me in real life, Todd. <laughs> Two and a half minutes to go here in the fourth. Second and seven. Rutgers down by six. Oh, bad pass, bad pass! And dropped a break there for Rutgers as both the receiver and the corner got there at the same time. Again, I realize these things just when they're kind of leaving my hand. <laughs> Third and seven coming up. And it's picked off the third interception of the day for Kalkamanis. And that might be the end to the winning streak. Threw it to the wrong receiver. I pressed the wrong button. I knew it as soon as I let go. I went to go for the guy on the crossing route. I didn't want the guy on the seam route. And now a quick pass to the flat. And there he goes. There goes Williams. A wide receiver screen. That might be the ball game. Wisconsin already in field goal range. Van Dyke in shotgun. And he's going to let it hit the two-minute warning. Well, this is the ball game. And just look at the way he's weaving through the line. That's, that's been the hardest thing is, is like, even when it feels like you got him for a loss, a Malusi has been so elusive. 
Rutgers uses their first timeout. And again, just cutting it back, picks up another yard. Well, this is the thing. Wisconsin, it's a 55-yard field goal, far from a chip shot. Van Dyke in shotgun. Man in motion. And up the middle, and the running back will pick up about two. So this is the game here. It's a 53-yard field goal attempt. If he makes this, it's game over. The Rutgers Cinderella season ends here. The kick is up. And it is good, and that is the difference in the game. Their kicker is great, and our kicker sucks. With the Wisconsin Badgers come to New Jersey and will knock off the undefeated Scarlet Knights, who will fall to 5-1. and one. Benjamin will take it, again, barring a miracle here. Uh, you know, I mean, it's, it's hard. You know, we made some really bad passes. It was the turnovers. The turnovers is what got us, right? We lost the turnover battle 3-1. to one. You're not going to win that game. They scored 10. And, and then, by the way, they only scored 10 points off of turnovers. Mind you, we scored 7 off the one we forced, but that's the difference in the game. The turnovers. As that's going to get knocked away. Play action to Benjamin. And now dumps it off to the running back, who's got a lot of room to run. He's still running. He'll get out of bounds at the 41. Kalkamanis in shotgun. Play action. He's got a man in. Oh, he's got him wide open. Miller, touchdown. Well, now if you believe in miracles... Rutgers quickly strikes. Obviously, they're just going to go for the PAT here. It's good. It's a two-point game. Well, now it's onside kick time, folks. With only one timeout, if Rutgers doesn't get this, a little squib kick, and it is co collected by Wisconsin, and that's your ball game. So, Rutgers put up a fight there at the end. They did score three touchdowns. Kalkamanis, by the way, three picks. Th three touchdowns to go with his three picks. But that is all she wrote. And Wisconsin comes into Jersey to win 23-21. to 21, A nail-biter until the end. Nate White, your player of the game with two touchdowns for Wisconsin, including that massive 75-yard touchdown run. So Rutgers falls to 5-1. and one. Uh, Amir, I don't know. I don't know offhand. I really don't. <laughs> Damn, exactly, RTO. So both teams now 2-1 and one in the conference. Both teams 5-1. and one. Obviously, now, though, the tiebreaker goes to Wisconsin. And it locked a lot of guys out. A lot of guys saw that loss and are like, we are no longer interested. Take care, RTO. As UCLA now comes to town. See you tomorrow, everybody. We're just going to do the quick rec recruiting mini game here and then save because I want to see all the guys who turned me down now. Yep, this guy went to went to Army. Wow, committed to Army over us. Okay. 
this guy, we know this guy was a long shot anyway. Womp womp. So a lot of guys changing their minds. That's what happens when you lose. And this guy's a bust, which means we are going to Remove him. Let's see. A lot of guys are close. I'm gonna really try to get this guy with us. We're gonna start sending the house now. See if that, uh, if that works. Did that not work? It did not work. That worked. I guess I couldn't, for whatever reason, I couldn't do more, but we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. Hopefully this guy chooses us. He's coming for a visit soon. Gotta start, start getting some guys. At least we got this kid, Eric Fort. Camp from Camden. This guy, we're, we're... I don't have enough hours. I need to remember. need to remember to... Use the hours to schedule a visit with some of these folks who I can do that with. Harder on this right tackle here. Build up the offensive line a bit. Oh, man. That's tough. That's tough. So. Anyway. All right, everybody. That's going to do it for us here now. I really appreciate it. We'll be back tomorrow with more college football. We're 5-1. and one. Still way overperforming for Rutgers, but... That was a tough one. That was a tough pill to swallow. We'll see you all tomorrow, though. Thanks for watching. Good night, everybody.